Okay, this is going to be a really quick video showing you how to set up Pizzicato using East-West strings. The library I'm using is the Symphonic Orchestra Gold Complete. And I have the violin, viola, and cello loaded with each of the MIDI numbers matching the MIDI numbers here. Now, in order to get the pizzicato to work, yeah, you have to go to the preferences and the, under the playback controls. And these folders here I created by going to new folder and naming it and then adding a new technique. Here, as you can see, I've already added our solo violin, solo viola, and solo cello. And under each, I added a new technique by hitting new technique. And here the, I chose violin and chose pizzicato. Now I set this to key switch. Now the way to finding the number that corresponds to the correct key switch is a little hard. First we go to score manager and go to the player. Here we will find all the key switches associated with the solo violin, the solo viola, and the solo cello. For the solo violin, in order to find the number of pizzicato, here it shows D sharp 1 as the key switch for pizzicato. Now finale numbers these different. Instead of starting with 0, its finale starts with 1, so technically this will be D sharp 2. And on the finale website, you can actually find a MIDI note to patch table. Here I look for D2 sharp and it shows that it's number 39. And under violins, I, I set the key switch to number 39 to correspond with the number that Finale gives me. And I just went ahead and did this to the violin also which is a different number 37 and also the cello which the key switch number is 90. Now this is the result. <laughs> Thank you for watching this video.